I'm Ryan, and we're the McDermott family. What do I love most about First Church? I love most, first of all, the people. What do we love most? We love most the church family. And, you know, a church isn't a building. It's the people in the building. And what we love most about it is the diverse congregation and that there is something for each of us to help serve in. I just love the fellowship of the like-minded people here, the opportunities for Bible study, women's ministry, men's ministry, and all the opportunities for personal growth and to draw closer to Christ. What do I love most? Uh, serving Christ through this church. I spent many years in running all the outreach ministries of the church, and there's no doubt in my mind that they were the happiest years of my life here. Through the years, they've become our family, and that's what I think I love most about this church. It feels like my family, a place that's comfortable to be, a place where I know people and they know me, and I can just come no matter how I'm feeling, whatever's going on in my week, I can come here and feel the spiritual presence of Christ with my friends. And we have really enjoyed the children's ministry that is at First Church. The boys and Blanding really enjoy all the activities and all the extra fun things that are here. What I love most about First Church um, is how much the church, um, how much the church reaches out to the community. Um, when I found out about our food share program, um, I just loved that so many people in the church came together to do such a, a selfless act um, and do something to really reach out to the broader community and. So um, are we, the reason we started here is because we were looking for a preschool. We moved here in August and we had a three-year-old and a five-year-old and we were looking for a preschool and someone recommended, oh, the Methodist Church has a really good preschool. So we came here, met Nina Cavacci, and Nina said, try coming to church this Sunday. So we did and we've never left. Both of us talk about Bethlehem Revisited and the youth and program. That's really what brought us to the church. But the people and the family and the friends, that's what's keeping us here. So we love it. Uh, we were going to go church shopping, and this was our first stop. And uh, we never left. But I've been here for over four years, and I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> I love First Church. <laughs> What they do for the kids here at First Church, we really fell in love with, and then made some good friends and uh, got into a good small group, and so really, you know, just loving the church. Uh, one of my favorite memories is during his uh, preschool time is with Pastor Larry and Pastor Keith. They used to do music and um, tell Bible stories, and also with Janet Brockway, and that just was very telling of the church that their pastors were involved um, with the children. Um, my favorite memory is probably when I first came to the church, you know, I didn't have God in my life for way too long. And, you know, this church really, like, is a reason I have a relationship with God. Now, what is the highlight of the church for me here is this is where I met Jesus as my savior. Christ has been with us so long. I don't know what I'll do without him. This church has really grown, all for the good. There's a lot of things that go on that nobody ever will know, but that doesn't need to happen. Nobody needs to know them. So we've seen a tremendous change in this church, and it's been wonderful. I think my favorite thing about it is watching how our church never gets stale, never gets old. Something new is always seems to be on the horizon. Um, but one of my favorite things is over the years that we've developed this amazing family as a student ministry and, and we've been able to see God do amazing things and, and I'm just glad to be a part of this family. And we've been blessed with incredible pastors. We came here a couple months after Harry Boss. He came in July and we came in August. And it seems like each pastor we've gotten has just been wonderful and wonderful and great sermons and I'm always happy and welcome to invite friends. Try this church. Come find me. I sit on the left side. You won't be sitting alone. It's, it's who's in charge of this church. It's not us. It's the man above. And he does so much. He puts so much into people. He lets them know what to do. He helps you. And that's what you learn here, that Christ is with us all times. And First Church has afforded our family community. 
and being involved in the church in so many aspects, including Bethlehem and church committees and uh, just your friends become part of the church and the church is part of you. I'm, I've made some of my deepest and most lasting friendships in my prayer group. Over all the years, this has always been a friendly, welcoming place to be. And we've just made lifelong friends here. Uh, First Church is where um, we met Jesus. This, it's where we became um, Christians, not just Methodists. My activity in the church became a service to God. The whole attitude changed and I became extremely active. Um, I was involved in Bible studies which really connected me um, with other women and uh, the Bible again which I was really missing. My future hopes for the church is that we don't change, that we continue to be the loving, open arms, mission-based church that we are. I, I really want to see um, First Church uh, just be an ambassador for Coral Springs and just our area. And I want to see us take over the community and show, show God's love, really, because that's what we're all about. We love First, right? I'm excited about the future of the church and our family being a part of this church and growing in this church. Um, I'm excited to watch our kids grow up in this church, learning about Jesus and uh, sharing experiences with the other families here in the, in the church. What my future hopes are for the church is to do more stuff like this. There are so many children that are out there hurting, that don't have, that need things and whatnot. And I'd like to see the church reach out and just pull these children in who are tomorrow's hope for the church and let them know just how much the Lord loves them and how much everybody here is there for them. So my future hope for First Church would be that First Church would be able to reach out like they reached out to me and provide, continue to provide opportunities for growth, personal growth, for our community, for our families, and for each other. What I would hope for the future of the church is that its congregation will enable it to continue to win souls for Jesus like it won mine. For the future of the church, as long as Christ is always honored and respected, and the kids coming up behind us learn that through Sunday school and through teaching, and from some of us who have been around a long time, that is the, to me the utmost. Christ should always be honored first. All the other things that we do is wonderful, but just to represent and honor Him is, is where we should be. What do you like about this church? That we talk about Jesus.